Welcome to 64 Sutton Street, and it is the home of Big Kitchen Events, and you're gonna see us and me at the home turn at Caulfield this year, cooking for spring racing. So, what's on offer? Lots of fresh, beautiful, fun food, and I'm gonna give you a tempter right now with a simple little salad that you'll be able to taste on the day. So, let's get stuck in. So let's get stuck into this salad. What I'm cooking is a sweet potato salad with tahini yogurt, lots of fresh herbs, wild rice, and some nuts and seeds, and some little raisins or currants to make it sweet. Very typical of the kind of food that I like. It's fresh, it's clean, but it's comfortable at the same time. And you can use any kind of combination of sweet vegetable, like carrots or pumpkin, to go in this salad. There's no rules, so if you're making it at home, give it a go. So, let's put it together. Some sweet potatoes, just sliced and roasted in the oven. It takes about 45 minutes until they go nice and caramelizey and sweet. And that's what it's all about, getting that sweetness. So I put a few of those in the bowl. And making food interesting and beautiful is quite easy. It's about kind of just throwing things together in the bowl. This is wild rice, which actually is not a rice. It's a type of grass. I'm gonna put some of that in. And then lots of little ingredients like this. These are sunflower seeds some pumpkin seeds, healthy, isn't it? So why do I look like this? Too much good food, that's what it is. Some shallots, and you can put some roasted onion or some garlic in if you want when you're cooking the sweet potato, nice and easy. And some little currants that we've soaked or blown, uh, that's what we call, in, we call it in the term, and a bit of uh, sugar syrup, just a few of those. And you can see what I'm doing, I'm just kind of layering up, making it interesting. And then some, some little, little herbs, and in this case it's coriander. And then I've got this tahini yogurt, and all I've done is taken tahini, which is a sesame paste, mix it with some lemon juice and some thick Greek yogurt, and you end up with a delicious dressing. You can thin it down a little bit if you want it kind of looser and you want to toss the salad together. But I want the ingredients to sing, that's why I kind of keep it all separate. So, just gonna put some little dollops in there. So it's like a curd, really yummy. Brings the whole thing together. It's about putting a little picture in a plate. It makes it appetizing and interesting. And never, ever lick your fingers when you're cooking. Excuse me. Did I do that? Right. Last little bit, other than seasoning. It's just a simple vinaigrette, lemon vinaigrette. And that ties the flavors together. Really yummy. Very simple, really fresh. We love to complicate things. So other than salt and pepper, which we'll sprinkle in, we've got some sumac, which is a lemony spice. And that works really well with that tahini yogurt, just gives it a little hit. And then also some dukkha spice, which is a mixture of nuts and spices, but principally cumin and coriander. And you know what? I love that, looks delicious. But then why not put another little layer in just to make things interesting and really colorful. You get the idea, don't you? You know what? Join us at the home turn, join me at the home turn, and you get food like that. Healthy, delicious. I think it's gonna kick the day off beautifully, don't you? So there you have it. Beautiful little roasted sweet potato salad with tahini yogurt, and we'll see you at the Crown Gold Nail Caulfield Cup Carnival. Can't wait.